900 kilometres north of Perth lies the laid-back coastal town of Carnarvon. Year-round, this place is absolutely beautiful. But don't let its small size fool you. This town packs a huge punch. Perfectly tucked between not one but two World Heritage Sites, Shark Bay and the Ningaloo Reef, Carnarvon is a must-see destination during your travels along the Coral Coast. And if you don't take my word for it, listen to the judges who've named it the top tourist town with a population under 5,000 people for 2018. Locals here actually call Carnarvon the food bowl of WA and it's no surprise it actually produces a whopping 70% of the state's fruit and veggies. It's even got its very own Fruit Loop Drive trail so you can check out all the deliciousness for yourself. The diversity of produce here is nothing short of amazing. The plantations here take up more than a thousand hectares of cultivated land. The industry itself is worth a whopping $104 million a year. And it's not just the land producing foodie goodness, it's the waterways too. With a thriving prawn, scallop, crab and fishing industry, much of WA seafood also comes from Carnarvon. You absolutely cannot come to Carnarvon without taste testing the local delicacy, a chalky coated banana. For me personally, it's like combining two of my greatest loves. Absolutely delish. A huge driving force that makes conditions so perfect for farmers to grow here is the Gascoigne River. At 760 kilometres long, it's the longest river in WA and Carnarvon is the point where it connects with the sea. This is actually an upside down river. It gets its name because the water flows beneath the surface, the sand acting as a stop from evaporation. In turn, farmers then get their water supply from bores beneath the surface. If you find you're in need of some chill out time, Robinson Street, Carnarvon's main strip, is a great spot to check out. And to finish off the day, what better way to do it than right here along the Facine on Olivia Terrace. This spot is a favourite among locals and visitors and with a picturesque view like this, it's no wonder why.